The History of Makeup by Neha Pothi. The oldest known makeup is from ancient Egyptian times. They use coal as eyeliner and mascara and other substances to make your skin more supple. Later, Greco-Romans used coal for the previously stated reasons, chalk for light lightening the skin, and rouge, which you wore on the cheek. White pale skin was viewed as a sign of wealth in the European Middle Ages, and many did whatever they could to achieve that look. Around the time of the Italian Renaissance, lead, although damaging, was applied in an effort to look paler. Arsenic was also used. Yikes. Makeup was seen in it as a health concern in Elizabethan e England, though some wore egg whites on their faces. During the French Restoration, lipstick and rouge were worn to look happy and fun. However, many thought the French were hiding something over under their, their painted faces. Rouge was important in the Regency era, as was many fatal whiten whiteners. The most lethal products were mercury and white lead, which were was used to whiten the skin. Even though it eventually became known that they were harmful, many continued using it. Belladonna was even put in the eyes to make them more vivid. It may be interesting to note that many men wore makeup un up until the 1850s. Victorians despised makeup and much preferred homemade face masks. Any tampering with skin tone was frowned upon. In 1917, the first mascara ever made was created by Eugene Rimmel. However, the first mascara invented the way we know was named Mabel, after the inventor's sister. The brand is now known as Maybelline. Around this time, the first pressed powders were invented. Up until the 1920s, the Victorian style was still in fashion. Afterwards, however, wearing li red lipstick was seen as patriotic. Lip gloss was also introduced to the scene. Celebrities introduced most of the trends from the 30s to the 50s. The 70s and 80s brought bright colors and heavily lined eyes. Now the main look appears to be more natural and a jumble of trends from the past. Even if beauty is only skin deep, it is fascinating to note how cosmetics have affected our lives and our past. Even though it may be thought useless by some, makeup has shaped our society.